Greetings 9-11 truthers. I recently uploaded a video depicting World Trade Center Building 2 uh, being demolished. Here it is again. Uh, it Right now it is loaded in my free video editor, Blender, which is the purpose of this video. I didn't like the way YouTube converted my video that I uploaded. It just did not show exactly what I wanted people to see, uh, which is right in front of you now, which is the bottom of World Trade Center Building 2 being demolished before the top even has a chance to get to it. If you look at this video closely, uh, it becomes quite apparent that demolition charges are being used. Let me hit escape and stop this. get it loaded again right and we can jump ahead some frames here right here you can see the top of the building tipping over if you follow the angle of this corner of the building down into the bottom lower part you can see that it is nowhere close to this part here jump ahead frame 10 frames you can still see the corner of the building right there. See that? And follow that and it's going into the building. Jump ahead again and that's jumped ahead 20 frames. You can see the bottom here being blown out. You just barely tell that the corner of the building is right about there going into this building here. But for some reason, obviously demolition charges going off. The building is blowing out down here. The corner of the building right here, which is in plain sight, is not being affected by the top building tipping over. It's still there. And here's the bottom blowing out some more. Here's some squibs here. There's a squib right there. Squibs there. A bigger squib. And finally, the bottom of the building blowing out well before the top of the building got to it. This obviously means that yes demolition charges were used. Uh, the evidence for thermite. Uh, obviously this is the building that you can see the corner where molten metal poured out. Thermite was used. There's no question in my, in my mind that this is demolition. But the real purpose of this video was to introduce 9-11 Truthers to Blender, which is a free program. You can download it free off the Blender website. This particular version is Blender 249. Uh, I'm using this because it uses the, the QuickTime Codex. I'm not sure how to say that yet. Codex. C-O-D-E-C-S. Codex. Uh, I like using QuickTime because I have other software that makes use of it, which I had to pay for. But if you're comfortable using other formats such as FMPEG, uh, there's plenty of other versions available all the way up to Blender 2.6. So enough said about that. You can get free software that will edit movies for free and meaning that you can download a movie such as the Twin Towers loop video available from AE 911 Truth up here you can see the address or you could actually get uh, recently FOIA released files off of the 911 dataset web page uh, these are available in uh, BitTorrent downloads you will need a BitTorrent downloader. Uh, one is available free at uTorrent. It works very good. It doesn't have any uh, adware included, although you do have to turn off a couple of the options to input adware. Uh, it's free. It installs. It works really great. I've been using it for several weeks now and had no problems with it. And it. it, it you're going to get more videos than you know what to deal with. Um, 
one word of note here is that if you do start downloading these torrents you will need a lot of storage space I happen to have a uh, two terabyte backup drive recently installed uh, for something else so once I was done with the something else I began to download these so far I've downloaded over one terabyte of data but enough said about this and that the real point of this video was blender 2.49 uh, B specifically and the fact that you can use it to edit videos such as the one I have currently loaded uh, the name of it should be right here somewhere oh uh, no it's not let me reopen my other file okay here it is this is the one I downloaded off of the AE911 Truth webpage right here and I had already edited it I have the frame selected 2186 to 2330 I have the codec already loaded and I have the sequence button already selected it will output a movie into the file I select right here <coughs> and it will play it on my computer uh, frame by frame if I so wish I can jump ahead 10 frames I can jump ahead one frame on it I can use desktop recording software which I'm doing right now and zoom in on it uh, there is a way to zoom in on it using blender but I've never really mastered that and it's kind of a headache and the newer versions do it better but I haven't played with it much but the point being here is that you can watch this frame by frame pushing the right arrow I'm going forward you can see the top of the building you can see the corner of the building here which is a key into letting you know what's going on here's the top of the building it's uh, pointed right at the center of the lower part of WTC2 the corner of this building is not being affected yet and jumping forward you can see that the lower part here is blowing out there is no way for this to be occurring unless demolition charges were being used. If I play it fast, you might actually miss this watching it on TV or watching it on YouTube. Although this particular sequence and this particular angle makes it pretty damn obvious that demolition charges were used you can see that the top has nowhere come come nowhere close to this bottom here right now right there you can see a, a squib let's hit escape and stop try and zero in on it a little bit more pressing the up arrow you can see squibs coming out one two three four backtrack ten frames got a little bit of a delay uh, desktop recording software kind of clogs the system memory up while trying to run blender but now you can see there's one two three four five squibs there there's a squib there there's a squib there this building is being uh, blown apart from the bottom right below where the top it was said to be uh, the driving force this is no doubt in my mind an inside job uh, there's no doubt in my mind that Bush and his oil cronies covered this up. There's no doubt in my mind that Bush and his compatriots are guilty of treason and a few other things. Uh, and this was made available, uh, made apparent, because I have Blender, a free software tool in which you can load movies, you can watch them frame by frame, dissecting everything
from building seven to building one uh, you can even load videos which are available if you can find many about the Pentagon uh, Shanksville and just it is nothing but inside job wrote all over this but again the main point of this video was that you become aware of the fact that blender 249 or any version of blender pretty much comes with a video editor a whole bunch of other features but the video editor is the cool part uh, for this particular use again it's available at blender.org and resources are available uh, BitTorrent downloads are available a free BitTorrent downloader is available and the software that you need to use or can use to watch videos like this and even make movies if you so choose once you learn how to use it there is a bit of a learning curve but you can get tutorials on YouTube you can get tutorials at wiki um, I don't know what more else I could say about this this is obviously demolition uh, this should get out to as many people as possible one reason I hesitated about uh, revealing blender to YouTube users before uh, I didn't want the debunkers to have such a neat free tool they would just use it to no end to put out crappy vi uh, videos uh, denouncing 9-11 truthers but I feel that the 9-11 truth movement has pretty much entrenched and the ability to look at movies like this would only further the cause uh, put Obama on the spot and say hey what about arresting George Bush 9-11 was an inside job and he covered it up when are you going to get to that I don't want to digress too much into politics but you can realize the implications here especially when you watch a video like this and you watch it in stop action mode So I wouldn't know what else to say in regards to this so I guess I'll end this video right here again blender is available free at blender.org resources are available free you can start with AE 911 truth or you can go to the all torrent download page and download as many videos as you want to your heart's content you can use a uTorrent downloader which is free and we can spread the message even more next year is an election year and we should get the message out loud and clear uh, I guess that's it and I'll wrap it up